up everybody uh, it's your girl Michi Monroe and today's video is all about one particular product that I had the uh, chance to use and I wanted to kind of share with you all what I thought about the product um, how it worked with my hair and of course if you're watching this video you know that this is a review for the original Moxie product line So as many of you guys know, um, obviously I'm a product junkie, I love trying different products and when I was presented with this opportunity it was almost uh, an absolute 100% yes because Original Moxie is actually one of um, our sponsors for the Monroe Sisters Atlanta meetup that my sister and I are having. So, so of course I said yes, I'll try the products, I'll let you guys know how it works for me. Um, I received a package in the mail with tons of different products for my sister and I to try and not only did I receive the products in the mail but I also received a few things if you guys can see here all right so what I did get is um, a pamphlet of information that has the different quality ingredients that original moxie has and it's herbs and botanicals natural emollients um, SLS free cleansers non-toxic preservatives and essential oil fragrances and also on the same information card on the other side it talks about the enlightened practices um, so handcrafted formulas environmental stewardship and health cruelty free testing and holistic hair care solutions and if you aren't sure about the product or if you you know just kind of want to know what you're putting in your hair this is really good so there is a certain type of chart that Original Moxie Hair product uses, and it's called the 3D Revolution. What that is, is density, dryness, and degree of curl. So I know that a lot of natural hair women are kind of confused about their whole curl pattern and the hair typing system, which can be really, really confusing. Um, but it's a little easy to know if your hair is either fine or thick, dry or oily, or straight or kinky. And there's different levels of that there that way you'll be able to kind of see where you fit in and, and these products are targeted to those with different hair types you just kind of have to find out where you fit in I believe all of this information is also on original moxie's website which is originalmoxie.com also on the other side of this information card um, it talks about the different types of hair types that I guess you can have straight and sleek all the way to curly kinky and coiled and this is where I fit in and it lets you know the type of products that you can use to cleanse your hair to condition or to style based off of your hair type so I think that this is great because there's products for everyone it's not just you know if you have looser curls or if this would work better like some products obviously work better for people with different types of hair um, this is great because it looks like there's products targeted to all people with different types of hair types so um, I received both of these cards in the mail as well as the products. And then of course Rachel over at Original Moxie also sent a letter um, that actually says a little bit about the products that she sent us and what we can use them for, how they would work and in what order. I thought that that was extremely thoughtful, extremely professional, um, and it really just speaks volumes about the company and kind of what they stand for. Um, and then their uh, actual slogan that they have. Um, original moxie be beautiful okay and if you can see that here after reading all of the information on original moxie looking at like the charts and kind of how all of that worked obviously I was extremely excited to try these products out but I had to wait a little bit I had to wait until my hair needed to be washed because I was sent um, shampoo and conditioner to try out so what I did is that I waited until I had a dirty head of hair and my hair was dirty guys it was extremely dirty um, I had coconut oil throughout my entire head for a pre-pull and I tried the shampoo. Right now the name of the shampoo is actually Get Clean No Foam Shampoo and it's for normal or dry hair. This is actually an 8 fluid ounce bottle. This shampoo is a no foam, no suds kind of shampoo. It's very, very herbal. The smell of it is very herbal like it reminds me of some oils that I've used before in like my Ayurvedic shampoo bar that I use because I like strong scents. This is a very strong scent um, and I believe my sister Miss Vine kind of touched on it when she did her shampoo review um, and I'm a huge fan of herbal smelling products. I don't really like the ones that smell like flowers and things I mean I guess that's okay but I like the way that it, it smells in my hair because it's such a different scent that it, I pick it up all the time. I like nutty, earthy type of, I guess, scents. 
Um, so this one was really good to, to clean with. Um, I'll be honest, I was a little bit nervous about the whole no suds thing because as I was washing my hair, um, it, it didn't suds up at all. So I continued to, you know, you know put work my hands through um, and I wasn't sure if my hair was getting clean. But after I rinsed it off, I had tons of coconut oil in my hair, okay? After I rinsed it all off, I washed my hair twice and um, my hair was extremely clean. It wasn't squeaky, whereas my hair texture felt strange. Um, it was still very soft, very shiny, and um, this actually really, really did the job. One thing about the shampoo is that even though it doesn't set up um, and it's not extremely foamy, you really don't need a whole lot for your hair. I have extremely thick hair and um, I think the first time around I probably overused the product because I thought that I needed so much. But after the first time I'm like, okay, I washed it out and I tried again and I only used like a handful, a palmful of it throughout my entire head and it really got the job done. So um, even though it doesn't set up, it definitely does cleanse your hair. And um, with the name like Get Clean, it definitely, definitely does what it promises to. So after I washed my hair with the clip that you guys just seen, I washed it all out. Um, I wanted to obviously do a, a conditioner. So what I used was the conditioner that Original Moxie sent and it is called the Intense Quench Deep Conditioner. It's for dry hair and it's made with hibiscus and strawberry. Um, this, con this conditioner is actually very thick. Okay, I remember when I first tried to pour it out of the bottle, I was trying to squeeze. It's a very thick coating conditioner, so it took a while for the, for the product to come down. It's very slippery, and I like that because when detangling, I don't just detangle dry hair, I don't detangle just wet hair. I have to have some sort of product in there that's slippery that would allow me to gently glide through with either a comb, my fingers, my tangle teaser, which I love. The tangle teaser is actually what I used when I detangled my hair. So this was really good. It's very thick. I didn't have to use as much as I thought. Very um, slippery, like my fingers kind of just glided through my hair, which was really good. This has an herbal smell as well. Um, it kind of smells minty and I can smell a hint of fruit. I guess that's kind of like the strawberry. Still smells awesome. What I did is I put this on my hair, I put on a shower cap, and I kind of walked around the house a little bit to do like a deep conditioner treatment. Um, but it does say, you know, about 15 minutes maybe under a heated uh, dryer or wrap your hair in a plastic cap. Um, so they have instructions as to how you should use the products. And it also has on the bottle, like all of the products, even the uh, shampoo, what type of hair it's for. All right, so that kind of shows you there. Of course, my hair is thick, it's dry, and it is definitely kinky. So this really works out, and um, I think that uh, the team over at Original Moxie did a really good job with sending products that would work for my hair. These two in combination was great. Um, the shampoo left my hair cleansed yet moisturized and the follow-up with the conditioner was great for detangling extremely slippery um, And it, my hair felt great. It was kind of tingly on the scalp not really where it felt crazy But more so kind of refreshing um, So I really enjoyed using these two. All right. I was also sent um, a box of samples now the box is super cute it's all you know kind of small there is a um, sticker there, the original Moxie sticker, the symbol, and inside the box, which I wasn't expecting, is five samples, and each sample actually comes with a card that wraps around the bottle. It's kind of like an elastic, kind of stretchy band there. All right, on the card, it lets you know what the product is that you're sampling, the instructions. And not only that, but it also has the ingredients. So I received two shape shifter, shape shifter samples. I received one hair bling, and I received also two just gels. All right, so five all together. So after I washed my hair, I was trying to kind of figure out what I wanted to do with it. Obviously, after I wash, I my hair is left in braids, so it's already detangled and I either braid it or twist it for the week. I kind of, you know, I kind of set it in some sort of curl pattern because I'm really not the hugest fan of wash and goals in winter here in Chicago, all right? So what I did is I wanted to try out these samples. I wanted to see how these could work for my hair and if I can receive um, the same type of definition. But what I did is that I layered all three of the samples that were sent to me. I made sure that I dampened the hair before I twist it. I added um, a little bit, maybe like a finger full of shape shifter. 
a little bit of the Just Gel, and then I top that with the Hair Bling. Um, most naturals know that they always say seal your moisture in with some sort of oil, shea butter, some sort of, you know, something, an oil that will seal the moisture in. So I decided to use a hair bling now. This normally is to add shine for thick, normal to dry hair. Um, not only did it add shine, but I also use it as like an oil because some of the ingredients in the hair bling is jojoba oil, mango butter, vitamin E oil. Um, beeswax there's a lot of different things in here so I thought that it would be really good so these three in combination now if you check out the clip that's coming next I actually show you guys how I use it on my hair and the type of curl definition that I got um, with simply using just a little bit of the gest gel the shape shifter and then you know pairing that with the gest bling 